One of the simplest recipes I know for dessert with caramelised apple balsamic is an apple stuffed with raisins, brown sugar, caramelised apple balsamic, a little bit of cognac and slow baked in the oven. Beautiful. Very simple, four ingredients. First you start with an apple. We're just going to take the top off the apple and we need to hollow it out because we're going to make a really a well for this beautiful marinade, this stuffing that's going to go inside the apple. So I'm just taking the core out of the apple. I'm just using a spoon. You might have a fancy apple core. I don't. I have a spoon. And we're just going to remove the seeds and the core. Don't worry about throwing this away. It is just the core after all. And we just made a well. Into the well we need to make a stuffing. Our stuffing is made from raisins, brown sugar, lira, caramelised apple balsamic, the caramelised apple balsamic is bringing to this marinade two things. It's bringing the sweetness, but it's also bringing the acidity of the balsamic as well. We mix those together. Optional, but I like to, is just add just a little bit of brandy. Not too much, but it'll bring a little zing to the dish. So we've made this marinade of the raisins, the brown sugar, the cognac, and the caramelised apple balsamic. We're just going to spoon that into that hollowed out well of the apple. This dish really needs some salt. Now you could just add salt if you want to, because salt will actually bring out the natural sweetness in the apple. But I actually like to add some goat's cheese, which has a natural saltiness to it anyway. It'll also bring a really nice creaminess to it as well. Just a bit of goat's cheese, the lid on the top, and into a baking tray. Now if you don't want to do apples, you can do pears. I've already hollowed out one before. Same thing, we're going to fill it with the stuffing of the raisins, brown sugar, caramelised apple balsamic and cognac. Some goat's cheese. And into our baking tray as well. Now we're going to bake these very slowly, about 150 degrees for about 30 minutes or until they just start to soften. And they'll go straight to the oven and we'll show what they look like when they come out. So it's been about half an hour in the oven. We've removed our apples, which have baked down beautifully. There's a beautiful sauce in the bottom. Pretty simply, look, we use mascarpone cream, but a little bit of cream, uh, thickened cream, a uh, little bit of cream fraiche, whatever works for you. And a chance to actually show one of the other great uses for caramelised apple balsamic is as a garnish. So by putting just a few drops around the plate, we can add beautiful sweetness to this dish, as well as make it look pretty on the plate. And that is baked apple with uh, brandy, uh, raisins, brown sugar, baked an apple, slow baked with mascarpone cheese.